So what's your name? You, you know my name. No, but this is for like we're videoing it. You've got to introduce yourself to the people that are watching. It. Well, I raced at top level. Uh, trouble was, I didn't get the, the chances, and I didn't have the money that that the competition had. Or I would, I was better than the competition always. Ask anyone, I swear they'll say as stiff as you can get it. And I just had didn't have everything they had, and I didn't have the luck they had. But there was no question, I was. I was better than them. I fell off a lot, but that wasn't my fault. One season I fell off 34 times. Only one time was it my fault. And, and even that, it was, uh, there was, I went into corner and a pigeon came along and I swear you, you wouldn't believe it. I slid on it and down I went, but the other um, 33 times was somebody else's fault. It's nothing to do with me. I'm just living my dream. I mean, our, uh, our dream, we're living our dream. How old was your son when he first started riding bikes? He'd be six, six months. Six could, months old? Yeah, he couldn't walk, but I knew he, he wanted to ride. He was, he was doing all this and this, he was doing this. And the, th the thing with me is that I'm always ahead of the game. For example, he went to school at three or nursery <laughs> I pulled him out he was colouring in is that thing not a, a ratchet it's it, that's not ratchet no a ratchet it, it's not it don't work works. I don't know I don't know what it is but it don't work look from that moment on it's basically smoking mirrors because no one really knew what age he was I know that's not strictly legal but when a kid has a talent you can't hold them back you've just got to get them out there get them racing it doesn't really matter about anything that's legal or not legal you can't waste the talent like that so all the way through his career he's always going to be a different age hey! <laughs> so how old is he now well he's he's actually 18 but on paper he's 11 or 12 so he's obviously ahead of the game he what doesn't paper how, you can't have changed his passport if we ever go abroad there's there's ways of fairly safely beating the system I'll put him under the kit bags I'll put him in a kit bag he's it's brexit that's brexit's happened so that means since brexit there are no borders <laughs> so I knew he'd be he'd go to Moto Three, then Moto Two, and then straight into Moto One. You mean Moto GP? Moto GP is that what it is? Yeah, the big one. Yeah, and World Championships along the way for sure. Well, I I go back a long way, and they're, they're guys I like to watch, and I've still got all the old videos, and I still I st still watch on people like uh, the American Kevin Schwantz. A British guy, Neil McKenzie, he was all right, and uh, and I, I liked that Italian guy, Frankie Dettori. He was he was good. Frankie like, Kelly. Uh, well, he was Italian. Frankie, Frank, he was Frankie. Eh? They just knew what each other was thinking all the time, and that that's the same with me and my son. Um, he was going to be a racer, it was, it's natural. He came out, he was born ready. <laughs> and and it's, and then on the bike it's telepathic. What I'm thinking, he does. Right, you can go. We've finished. This will be on YouTube, so we'll come back next time you're doing a bit of training. Is that on the telly? Yeah, it can be on the telly. What is it called again? And that's somewhere else I've been ahead of the game. It's <laughs> <laughs> another position. So, you've got to be in. You've got to be in. <laughs> I was on a roll, yeah. <laughs>
just gave me even more inspiration. But hey. <laughs> 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 Ha ha ha!